Welcome back students to e-learning platform Gyan Mantra Vidya Peet Online Education. Students, in today's video lecture, we are going to study the third lesson from our supplementary book, Snapshot. The name of this lesson is Ranga's Marriage. So, let's learn this lesson in detailed manner. Students, before we begin the detailed discussion of this lesson, there is given the introduction portion in the very beginning of this lesson. Let's see this portion first. Okay, students, you may keep your textbook with you. Ranga, the beginning portion of this lesson, we are going through. Ranga, the accountant's son, is one of the rare breed among the village folk who has been to the Sri to pursue his studies. When he returns to his village from the city of Bangalore, the crowds meet around the house to see whether he has changed or not. His ideas about marriage are now quite different. Or are they? So here we can find the kind of question mark. From the title itself, students, we can come to know about the clear idea, the concept, the theme, the central idea of this lesson. The title of this lesson is Ranga's Marriage. So from this title, we can come to know that inside portion of this lesson, there will be something about marriage. And who is the central character of this lesson? That is Ranga. So here we are going to discuss about Ranga's marriage. What is the special about this marriage that also we will discuss. In the earlier stage of his life, the thinking ideology of marriage was something different. And nowadays also the thinking ideology thoughts of the people about the marriage are totally different. So what is about Ranga? Was he thinking different and now also he is thinking different, is it so? Or right now also he has the same ideology about the marriage like the earlier stage of life. Let's discuss in detail and let's come to know. Okay, so the very beginning portion of this lesson, the beginning, you may textbook also with you students, your supplementary reader snapshot, Ranga's marriage. Okay, now we are going to begin the discussion, the explanation portion from our snapshot. When you see, when you see this title, some of you may ask, Ranga's marriage, I mean what's that? Why not Ranganatha Vivaha or Ranganatha Vijaya? I mean why these titles are not given but Ranga's marriage? Why? Well, yes. I know I could have used some other mouth feeling one like Jagannatha Vijaya or Girija Kalyana but then this is not about Jagannatha's victory or Girija's wedding. It means this title are, these titles are very well known or something like these titles also could be chosen but it is not so. The title is something different that is Ranga's, Ranga's marriage. The reason also has been said here, mentioned here by the writer that it is not that much uh, about the victory and that's why the writer has not chosen the titles among those. It's about our own Ranga's marriage and hence, no fancy title. Hoshali is our village. The name of the village is also mentioned here. You must have heard of it. No. What a pity. Means, have you not heard about this village, the name of this village? Oh, that is so pathetic. So pity about that. The writer says about this. But it is not your fault. There is no mention of it in any geography book. Means, uh, suppose you refer the book of geography. There is no even mention about this village. So that's why it is natural that you don't know anything about this village because uh, according to the geography, it is not mentioned on the book of geography. Those sahibs in England writing in English probably do not know that such a place exists and so make no mention of it. Our own people do forget about it. You know how it is. Actually, 
it is said that people actually forgot to mention these things because they even didn't know that these kind of places also here in the existence on the earth in the world and that's why this kind of uh, authorized people also forgot all these things and that's why because of these only thing actually there is no mention about our village on the book of geography and sometimes even our people also forget all these things you know how it is our own people to forget about it you know how it is they are like a flock of sheep one sheep walks into a peat the rest blindly follows it when both the sahibs in england and our own geographers have not referred to it you cannot ex expect the poor cartographer to remember to put it on the map can you it means here the comparison has been made um, uh, the people with the sheep it means the sheep are habituated to follow one another if one sheep is going on the straight path the another also will follow the same way so there is no kind of particular ideology or to be different or to rebel anything no one person is there who is following the path rest of the people also will follow the same path so actually these people think that and it is also mentioned here that when the highly authorized people also forget the village to mention on the map how can we expect this thing from the poor poor people of the village area so it is not the big thing that if it is not even mentioned on the map so naturally it will not be remembered by the people also so it is not strange here right now for the writer can you means can we really expect this thing from the people can we and so there is not even the shadow of our village in any map not even a shadow not even a sign no even signal we can find like the shadow even on the map not even a single thing, single thing the writer wants to say next paragraph sorry i started somewhere and then went off in another direction if the state of my sir is to bharat varsha watch the sweet curry dabu is to a festive meal then hoza ali is to my sir state watch the feeling is to the curry dabu what i have said is absolutely true believe what i have said is absolutely true believe me i will not object to your questioning it but i will stick to my opinion i am not the only one who speaks glowingly of hosa ali we have a doctor in our place his name is gunda bhatta he agrees with me he has been to quite a few places no not england if anyone asks him whether he has been there he says no anaya i have left that to you running around like a flea pester dog is not for me i have seen a few places in my life though as a matter of fact he has seen many here it is all about the description of ranga's marriage right now it is not about the incident about the marriage particularly but it is said about the bharat varsha so many names you may uh, find the remarkable names considering the name of south indian culture so the names you will find little bit strange and what is said here see what i have said is absolutely true believe me i will not object to your questioning it but i will stick to my opinion means the writer wants to say that i am not saying that you are wrong but i want to say that i am right i am not saying that you need to change opinion but i just want to mention my opinion on you so here we can find the kind of paradox between the mentalities ideology and the thinking 
I am not the only one who speaks glowingly of Hosahali. This is the kind of name. We have a doctor in our place. His name is. What is the name of this doctor? See, his name is Gunda Bhatta. This is the name of the doctor. Very strange name we can find because we are not habituated to listen this kind of words. So, it is little bit strange for us. He agrees with me. The person agrees with me. With me means with the writer. The person becomes agree with the writer. He has been to quite a few places. No, not in England. If anyone asks him whether he has been there, he says, No, Anaya, I have left that to you. Means not declaring the name of the place. Running around like a flea pester dog, it is not for me. I have seen a few places in my time though, as a matter of fact, he has seen many. Actually not only in one place or two places, but it is actually the fact that he has seen, he has visited so many places uh, within the life. Later on uh, in this lesson, we will find the description about the marriage. The marriage of Ranga. Uh, it is very interesting um, incident. So that also we will study. We have some mango tree in our village. Yes, students, you can find description only about the village and all that how they were doing, how places were there, how things were arranged, what they were habituated to do. So all these things you may find uh, through this lesson. In this lesson, we have some mango trees in our village. Come visit us, and I will give you. A raw mango from one of them. Here it is the kind of invitation that you may come to my village and I will give you the mango. How kind of mango? See, a raw mango from one of them. A raw mango I will give you. Do not eat it. Just take a bite. No need to eat it the full. You may just take a bite, a little bit. The soreness is sure to go straight to your Brahmandra. I once took, it means, uh, here it means to say that it is very sore in the test. So, you will not be able to eat the whole at once. That's why it is said that you may take one bite from this mango, not the full. I once took one such fruit home and a chutney was made out of it. It is said about the chutney. Because it was sore, so it was not... Um, that was not uh, the people were not capable and they were not even able to eat it at once and that's why they made chutney the kind of sauce from that all of us ate it they enjoyed that chutney a lot here you can find uh, the matching of Indian language with English language uh, so many words we have that in English vocabulary but the writer has not mentioned all the English words here so many Indian words the presenting the culture of the specific area these words are also mentioned here so this thing also is very remarkable according to this lesson all of us ate it the cough we suffered from after that it was when i went for the cough medicine that the doctor told me about the special quality of the fruit the cough we suffered from after that it means when we ate that chutney, when we enjoyed that chutney, after that, we people, we family members who actually enjoyed this chutney, the sauce, well, we suffered from cough afterwards. And that's why doctor told us, see, it was when I went for the cough medicine that the doctor told me about the special quality of the fruit. It means uh, doctor told us directly, specifically, and the doctor mentioned that because of this food, the special food, special quality of this mango, actually we are suffering from this cough, this kind of disease. So it is the kind of quality of this mango fruit. Uh, of course, it is a little bit tasty. It is sour also in the test. It is not eatable at once. Afterwards, uh, we have to eat it the whole. Okay, so we cannot eat at the same time. And because of this fruit, we can have cough also. So it is about the special quality of this fruit, mango. 
Just as the mango is special, so is everything else around our village. Means not only mango is special here, but so many things around us, these things are also very special for us. Not only about this mango. Means our village is very special. So the things around us in the village, these are also very special. We have a creeper growing in the ever so fine water of the village pond. Its flowers are feast to behold. Get two leaves from the creeper when you go to the pond for your bath. And you will not have to worry about not having leaves on which to serve the afternoon meal. Means here it is about the quality of leaves also. It is said here that whenever you go to the pond for taking bath, you may take these leaves also with you and you will not have to worry about not having leaves on which to serve the afternoon meal. Uh, means uh, in the earlier uh, old age time we can find the papers, the leaves we can find like the plates. Plates were not uh, that made like metals and steel and all. So there were leaves only uh, to serve the food. So here it is said about that leaf that you will not be worried about the leaves. Uh, in afternoon time when to sow. You will say I am rambling. It is always like that when the subject of our village comes up. But enough. If any one of you would like to visit us, drop me a line. I will let you know where Hosa Ali is and what things are like here. The best way of getting to know a place is to visit it. Don't you agree? It means suppose you find that you want to come here then no need to be worried. You may just send me a line. You may just drop me a line whenever I will come to know about the thing that you want to come here. Surely I will help you a lot. Because whenever we listen about the places, when we come to know about the places, we read about the places. But it is more, it is more advisable to visit the same place. Isn't it? At the end of this paragraph, the writer asks this question to the readers. Suppose we want to know a place in a better way, we should, we must visit the place. It is said here. So students, up to this portion we will end up today in this lecture. Okay, so we discussed in this lecture the introduction portion of this lesson, the Rangas. The title of this lesson is Rangas Marriage. In this lesson, we will find the description, discussion about the marriage of Ranga. Right now, we are going through, we are proceeding about the description of the village area, the fruit. It was the village was not known for the people. It was not even mentioned on the map also. So, it is very strange thing that the higher authority, the authorized people also forgot to mention on the map. So, the village was totally unknown for the people. Even the people of the village area also forgot that actually this kind of village is there in the existence. They were also compared with the sheep. And right now we are going through this kind of procedure. We discussed about the leaves also. And it is also asked that you should visit the place when you want to know in a better way about the place. Okay. So, it is all about the today's discussion suppose you find any difficulty any query you are free to ask me okay when we will go through this lesson in more detail then you will be able to understand in in a better way right now it is about discussion and description only that's why you will find something different but don't worry students whenever there will be the portion of story it will be easier for you but if you have any doubt you are free to ask me anytime. Thank you students. Take care of your health. Have a nice day.